What's up, y'all? This is Kyra, and this is my second video on this channel. And, you know, this week, Jill and I decided to team up, and we're going to do, like, a comedic week. So everything's going to be comedy-related. And so I'm also going to do a skit. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. So, let's get into it. Hey, Kyra, what's up? How you been? I haven't seen you in a minute. Well, you know, I haven't seen you in a minute. It's been chill, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I just... No, I've been chilling. Just trying to find some job, you know what I mean? It's been a little tough, you know. But I'm keep working at it. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So that's all right. Yeah, so how you been, Laquita? You know what's been up with you? Well, you know what I mean? I had a job, you know what I mean? But ever since the, my boss and all my employers caught me in the back, all snap. <coughs> you know what I mean? Uh, they just, you know, they decided to fire a girl, you know what I'm saying? So ever since then, I've been chilling up in the house, they doing jack, watching the TV, drinking the Kool-Aid, you know what I mean? So, I just been chilling in the cut, you know? Right. So you mean to tell me you got fired from your job because you were on Snap? You done all right, you ain't nowhere in the world. I'ma miss my snaps and getting on my stories and my timelines. <laughs> you know what I mean? So I can talk to my people, you know what I mean? So what, I'm at the job, they gonna have to work. I gotta talk to my people, you know? <coughs> That's what I'm saying. They gonna have to wait. I gotta get some contact with some folks, you know what I'm saying? So when I get out, we can go, <laughs> turn up, you know what I mean? <sighs> okay, quickly, you, you just, you continue to make me. Anyways, so, you know, I mean, what you plan on doing then? I mean, you just gonna continue to sit up in the house or are you gonna try to find something else? Well, you know, yeah. Um, been enjoying this relaxation time. What you talking about? Shoot, I ain't trying to look at doing all job. You know what I'm saying? I just be, <clears throat> cause now I can full time be on <clears throat> Snap. I can be on the, <clears throat> the Instagram. I could be in the DMs. Go down in the DM, by the way. And I could just, you know, I can just chill on my social media. You know what I'm saying? Get on my Twitter, check my tweets. You know what I'm saying? I retweet. You know what I mean? I'm chill about a job right now. You know what I'm saying? That, 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 that's chill. All right then. All righty then. Okay. Good luck with that. Yeah, girl. Anyway, enough about me. What's been up with you? I mean, you act like you don't know nobody. I mean, you can't call nobody. I mean, we can try everybody trying to get in contact with you on the side of the family. What's been up with you? You just hiding out. What's going on? Well, I mean, you don't get a clue. I haven't been contacting with y'all. I mean, y'all all ratchet as heck. I mean, why would I want to keep in contact with y'all? Y'all like to get them. I mean, what the heck? I'm not trying to associate myself with that. I don't care if y'all are doing friendly. Oh, I see how you are. You want to get bougie. You want to act like you don't know nobody. You want to act like you're not related to us. Are you for real? You don't want to contact your own, I mean, your own family, your own flesh. Your own flesh and, and, and blood. You know what I'm saying? You know how jacked up that is? I, I see you. I'm, I got you. I, I'm going to keep you on lock. I got you. Now, where you got from? Excuse me? As much as I put up with y'all, I should get an award for patience, for perseverance. Y'all are some crazy people. Jeez, you must be crazy. Anyways, I ain't got time for this. Look, I mean, it was nice catching up with you, but I gotta go. I can't deal anymore. All right, go on in. We don't need your bougie behind or around us, please. Hey, hey, girl, don't forget. Talk to me on Snap, DM, ha, holla. Oh yeah, 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 I'll get up with you. Ha. Bye. Ha, <laughs> it's so nice to take a drive every once in a while, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> what, who's beating on my window? <laughs> hey, Scar, is that you? Who are you, how do you know my name? I've never met you before. What are you talking about? Everybody knows who you are. You know what I'm saying? Your name stays out in the street. Not in a bad way. You know what I'm saying? But you know him. You know? Known for being a good-hearted person. So, that's why I wanted to ask you something. Um, what, well, I'm at a stoplight. What could you possibly have to ask me in a few seconds? Well, um, you know. You know, a girl been, you know, trying to get her, you know, her little 
Remy and her little weave pieces together, you know what I'm saying? But uh, I ain't got enough money to get me some bundles, you know what I mean? So I was wondering if you had maybe a 20 on you I could borrow, so maybe I could get me a bundle. Hey, bro, are you for real? You think you're gonna get a whole full bundle of weed for 20 bucks? Your head gonna be itchy for real. You gonna have some serious issues. You gonna end up having a rash or some kind of mess in your head? You better try to invest in some more money. I can, I can give you the 20, but that's not gonna do it if you want some really good hair. Girl, what are you talking about? You must not go to the place I go to where you can get three or four bundles for $15. You know what I'm saying? And your crown be looking sweet, you know what I mean? Well, it's hair. Maybe it's not sweet. Anyways, but. You know what I'm saying? It may not look the best, but at least it's on there, you know what I'm saying? At least I got something, you know? Can't be out here both, you know what I'm saying? Definitely understand that. Well, you know, I'm gonna help you out. All right, back. I'll give you $50. Here you go. We'll get you 10 bundles. That should do for a while, you know what I'm saying? Oh, thank you. See, I knew you had a nice heart. Thank you so much, Karen. Well, see you another time. Bye. Bye. Have a nice night. Be careful now. My goodness, we are in this cup. Like, we fool around across the street and somebody being ran your behind over. Be careful, please. Oh, well. Oh, oh, she's gone. Oh, okay. Lord, please watch over. All right, well, it's time to go to the grocery store. The Quad of Phoenicia, is that you? Zaniqua, is that you? I know that's not you. Girl, who else is it? You know it's me in the flesh. Oh. Oh, I'm sorry, bro. You know, I just didn't recognize you without your extensions, you know what I'm saying? It's a little different. Excuse me? You mean to tell me you don't know who I am unless I have extra hair on my head? Honestly, no. <laughs> you wear so much of it, I mean, that gets up your entire look. I ain't even gonna go there with you today. Anyways, how have you been? Well, it's not even girl. As you know, I recently just got married. And me and my husband just had a baby recently. Oh, you did? What did you name it? Well, you know, I am a Christian, so I wanted to name my baby something biblical, you know what I mean? Give her a name, some oath, to let people know this is someone that's after the Lord. Uh, all right, so what did you name her? I mean, did you name her Ruth, Esther, you know, something like that? Some of the powerful women in the Bible? Girl, no. I named her, I decided to name her, sorry. Prophetisha. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I like where you're going with the shot and the idea of you want to give prophet you think that she's going to be prophetic in, in the Lord when she grows up. But Prophetisha, are you for real? Why would you give your baby a curse of a name like that? Girl, what are you talking about a curse? That name is a blessing from the Lord himself. He sent it down from heaven. You know what I mean? That is blessed. That's blessed. You know what I mean? What are you talking about? That is a great name. Sure. All right, let's switch subjects because this is not going down in the path. Anyway, so, ooh, I like your nails. Who did them? Let me see. Oh, girl, you know, I go to the best nail salon, you know what I'm saying? You know, my nails are too short. And I think I'm probably going to go back and add another maybe two inches, probably have them to about out here, you know what I mean? And then they're going to be popping, you know what I'm saying? You do realize that it's not popping to have your nails to a length where they start to curl over, right? What you talking about? What kind of nail salon do you go to? I can get my nails out here if I wanted to, and they still wouldn't curl over. You know what I'm saying? And even if they did, that's what's popping. You know what I'm this is way too short right now. This is like, like a little bit past my nails. I mean, who wants that? I mean, if you really want to get some nails, you want them to be popping, you know what I mean? So I'm gonna go and get an extra few inches and really make them pop. All right, well, good luck with that. But, you know what I'm saying? I just got my new hair, you know what I mean? So as you can see, it's not as much extra as I usually have, but I did decide to dye it black, you know? I just want to be natural, you know what I'm saying? Because natural is the best policy, you know, when it comes to beauty. Everyone loves natural beauty, so that's why I decided to go to black, go back to my roots, you know? Mm, roots, <laughs> look like you need, the roots need a miracle look like, huh, from what I can see. Shoot. Dye your hair black and your roots is burgundy. Huh? You need Jesus. Anyways, I ain't even gonna go there, but. Excuse me? You gonna try to talk about my roots? When your hair look like it's crying for a waterfall? Oh, so now you gonna try to talk about my hair being dry when your hair look like it's about three days from breaking all the way off to an inch? Look, 
I didn't say nothing to you when you went bald and had patches around your head. Look, you know somebody messed me up on purpose. Put that bad part on my head and all my hair came No, that's not my fault. I don't care if it wasn't. You still needed help. You know, you be getting on my nerves anyways. Let's just end this conversation now before I end up blowing up on you. So, whatever. Anyways, so, I guess I'll see you later. Bye. Don't forget to text me. Deuces. Same here. Well, that's the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. It was definitely fun making it. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys like and subscribe. And I will see you guys in two weeks. And also, one last thing. Peace on the streets. And don't forget to check out my peeps. Daily will be up this coming Tuesday which is July 5th, 2016. And Corinne will be up next Thursday, which is July 7th, 2016. Don't forget to check them out. Deuce.